everybody doing? I see you following me all the way here. Plant City, Florida for the watermelon, first annual watermelon festival. Uh, so we're gonna see if we can get some watermelon and see what they got going on around here. Follow me, let's go. And I really wish I was a kid and had brought my swimsuit because it's about, I don't know, 90 degrees right now and they have this little thing, a uh, little slide. It's a water slide. Kids go down and have a good time. Well, let's go check out uh, the vendors. And they've got vendors here, like a, a nut vendor. There's all kinds of uh, different types of nuts. Hey guys, all Virginia peanuts, all powder based seasonings, sugar and carbs are low, flavors out the roof. Thank you guys. Use the hashtag grab these nuts. Get your umbrellas. So we're going to try the dill flavor, see how that is. Uh, you take a picture, you take a sample. We can do that. There you go. Thanks, man. Yep, use the hashtag really grab these nuts too. Oh, awesome. Post that picture. <laughs> And one of the best things ever that you can have here in Florida, a snow cone. And it's a do-it-yourself. You get to add all the flavors you want. Uh, some tea three here. Watermelon tea, obviously. So I think I'm going to go with the blue swamp water. Looks pretty good. So here's the swamp water. It was three bucks. Uh, they didn't have the blueberries in it, but what can you do? They're busy tonight. We're going to give this, give this a, a whirl with the swirly straw here. Bendy straw. Oh my goodness, that is delicious. So basically what swamp water is, it's half lemonade, half blueberry tea. Very, very good. I'll get this again. And they got some kettle corn here. Okay. It's always delicious. Okay. I just thought about that. No. We'll wait a little longer. And you can't have an outdoor festival without the barbecue. From Big Mama's Catering. Mmm, watermelon. Ah. Tell you, all these watermelons look delicious. You're gonna have to get a piece. So here at the Watermelon Festival, I ordered the medium slice of watermelon. They only gave me the small. <laughs> Let's see how it tastes. Tastes like a watermelon. And another small hot dog. Just like the watermelon. And some nice roasted corn. So for the corn, the hot dog, and the watermelon, it's all $13, which is pretty good. We're gonna try this hot dog now. Because it is just ginormous. Alright, see how it goes. That's a good dog. Eight bucks and the seedless one on six. So that is the seedless. And this is the lady. You're the the seed. Is. But that is a ginormous. Here comes the watermelon man. They are just running watermelons like crazy. Yeah. 
And here at the Watermelon Festival, if you want to grab uh, a hard cider, you can come over to the tent. They got this going on. Um, and then if you want wines, they have all different kinds of uh, wines here. And here at Keel Farms, they also uh, make wine and they grow grapes for that wine. but got a little turtle right there trying to get into the house maybe to get out of the rain that uh it looks like looks like it's coming and they got some uh, cows to check out look at these little guys The little babies. And we got the uncle Ron over here hanging out. And we got a good little picture spot here. It says Plant City, Florida. You're at Teal Farm. And very appropriately, they have some hay bales with painted uh, like a watermelon. That's kind of a cool photo uh, photo spot. And then they have this area, which is uh, the barbecue hall, where you can get some barbecue uh, set out here. And a nice little view of the pond. I'm not sure, but I think over there they might have uh, live bands. I think that's where the live bands are going to play. I don't know if we'll be around for that, but should be cool. And we are in a kids area where they can color some watermelon pictures. But I noticed they got this pretty cool uh, little bar set up, but what was really cool was the lights they have. Like old beer bottles. They're going all the way down. Pretty clever. So that is gonna do it for me here at uh, Plant City at the first annual Watermelon Festival. Uh, it was awesome. Uh, it was really cool and quaint. It was free parking, uh, free admission, and going in there getting the huge hot dog and the watermelon and the swamp juice, all that. Pretty good prices and uh, it was really fun. We survived the rain, uh, but hopefully they'll have a, a second annual uh, 
watermelon festival next year. But uh, until then, remember, there's only one way to live in the moment. <laughs>